happy Saturday. Hair update today. Lots of hair loss. Not, not as bad as it was like last week, but not as good as it was the last three days, um, which I have heard that it kind of comes and goes like that. So we're still better, but we're not really good. And I'll show you something. I have lots of new hair growth already, which is a great sign. All of these little pieces are like an inch and a half long already. I have lots of new growth that are about, these are about a quarter of an inch coming in right in here. They're all the same length. You can part my hair and see little stubbles that are about quarter of an inch, half of an inch long. So that's one good thing. Like I said on the previous couple of stories, um, they're not suspecting thyroid because it's not a typical thyroid hair loss. Um, this is a loss from something which they're assuming it's COVID. Um, so I had it in May. Um, so I just wanted to update you guys. I have a highlight of what I am doing. Um, so I guess it's basically from what I've heard from people and what I've read, it's just a waiting game. You just have to wait until your body is done pushing your hair off your head. <laughs> I'm only saying this because I get so many messages a day about it and I'm only keeping you updated because I know a lot of you are having the same thing. Um, as far as people who are saying it's hormone imbalance or from menopause, I went through menopause three years ago. I don't have any imbalances that I know of as of the last test. I would also be showing a lot more signs. Um, a lot of times if you lose hair, you have really high testosterone. But there's lots of other things that are going on when you do have high testosterone and I have nothing. Um, and number two, alopecia. People mention that all the time. I don't have bald spots. I have thin spots from losing hair, but there's already hair coming back in those spots. Those are gray. That's why you can't see them very well. But so I don't believe it's that. And again, my thyroid results are we're supposed to be back yesterday, but they're closed on Friday. So I'm expecting them to call me on Monday and let me know. But I think everyone will be shocked because I have zero symptoms of anything. It's just my. Okay, story time. Um, but first, I got an email from Dime Beauty that they are having a site-wide huge sale. 30% off. 30% off. D&D &D 30 will get you 30% off. Now story time. I always rave about this perfume that I cannot say, but I think I know how. I think it is Don Lavoie. Let me know if that's right. <laughs> As you know, we went to the Shania concert last Saturday, and before we left, of course, what I always do, I spray on my perfume. We got to our hotel, and I walked in to check in, and this particular place is really big, so it's got lots of different check-in spaces, it almost reminds you of like a bank when you walk up and there's a teller. That's kind of how it is. And I walked up and the girl standing beside me who was checking in said, Oh my gosh, you smell so good. What are you wearing? So here I am in the lobby explaining to this girl that it's from Dime Beauty. It's clean and I love it. And it is it smells just like another one that's $350. I'm explaining to her, giving her my coat. <laughs> I tell you all the time that I get asked that. We walk into places, people will say, oh my gosh, who smells good? Deb always says her. So try it. Try this one. Try Core Memory Clean Beauty Products. DND30 will get you 30% off site-wide. Don't forget, great gift ideas. Ran into a thrift store. Deb, yeah. where is New England? Where's who? New England. Where's who? Where's New England? In England. <laughs> I am going to get this done today. I just like quit in the middle of it all, but I have that much to do, so it shouldn't take long. And then Deb is going to put this up, but I think she might. I think we might do another shelf, like a 
not a not a huge shelf but maybe one that sticks out six inches five inches around there so i can set things up there and we'll put these in is going to be a piece just as bad or worse because it has this in it so I not only have to cut around that around that but I have to cut around that too ta-da saving the best for last here saving the best for last <laughs> Oh my gosh, when I was posting that, I saw a message come in and somebody said, your bras are on sale. I've, I'll put the message here. So I thought, I wonder how much they're uh, better than I've ever seen. So first of all, before I show you what they look like and the um, reasons that I love them, I've tried every bra under the sun. I used to come in the house and absolutely rip them off because actually... People at my old job used to laugh because I had a pile in the back seat. So I would crawl in to go home, rip it off and toss it. <laughs> Another thing, I refuse to wear underwire. Um, our doctor actually asked us if we did and we said no and he said good. So it puts too much pressure on your tissue and he's like, no good. So these are an excellent alternative. On that note, this is in place of the underwire. It's got this different type of stretchy here. And then it also has this section here. So it covers up anything that might spill over the top. As far as sizing goes, according to their sizes, I should have been a large and Deb should have been a medium, but both of us sized up. I love the extra large and she loves the, the large only because it's not tight at all like it's it's firm enough but it's not tight i have heard from so many of you that you bought these and have bought more and stocked up when they go on sale 16.99 today minus i think it said two dollars and 55 cents it's got like a coupon thing so make sure you click that my favorite trees are on major major sale it is it looks realistic feels realistic it comes in this pot so you don't have to worry about doing anything to that.